Hi and welcome, it's Valerie here with today's video and all the latest news. Bad news, unfortunately. For Sun City fans, stay tuned after this video. People started lining up five days ago. The band that lost on the X Factor. Selling out their entire tour in hours. Because of you, we're number one in 37 countries. We never expected any of this to happen. When I was little, I knew that I wanted to entertain people. Wherever I went, my dad used to tell people that I could sing. At school, I was always that guy to make people laugh. I used to get kicked out of class for singing Irish traditional songs. It'd be like three in the morning, and I'd be singing like top of my voice. That was where it kind of started. Oh, baby, baby. I don't know if you could have more of a dramatic life change. Just look at that. Like, it's absolutely amazing. We tried to stay away from the typical boy band thing. Like choreographed dance routine. Okay, on the top. <laughs> We're normal people doing this abnormal job. They're a bit tight. <laughs> <laughs> They always make fans laugh. <laughs> I know they love me, even they don't know me. We are so thankful. This is a teamwork between us and them. The fans were the ones who made up their minds that this band was going to be huge. The hardest thing about the trouble is missing home. We just come from normal working class families. You know the stand up boys? I want a Louis yeah. one. I can just go and say goodnight. That's my favourite hair on Liam. I miss my son so much. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> If I let you know Hello, sunshine. I know you always used to say, I'll get your house when I'm older. For you. Congratulations. So thank you. <gasps> it's lovely. Oh, thank you for what you've done for us. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> well, get off the phone then before I start crying. We're going to a bakery that I used to work in. Barbara! Hi! It's nice spending a bit of time with people who know what I'm actually like. How are you, you my love? my bum on the set. Yes, I did. Look at us. <laughs> when you come somewhere completely new, it's really exciting. Hmm. What is it? Miso soup. Miso yeah, yeah. soup. And you pour it into your razor. No, I think you drink yeah. it. You drink yeah. it, you drink yeah. it, you drink, yeah. it, you drink yeah. it. Make some noise! As a group, we've always got people to share your experience with. Nothing to see here, sir! They're not wrapped up in everything. Hey, keep their lens up here. <laughs> Just five normal lads having the time of their life. We love you, One Direction! Hang on, we've got something here. <laughs> <laughs> All you guys eagerly awaiting Sin City or Dame to Kill 4 will have to wait a little longer. The Weinstein Company announced that the film has been put back until 2014. The sequel had initially been expected to arrive in US cinemas in October 2013, but has now been given a new release date of 22 August 2014. The announcement doesn't specify the reason for the delay, only that Rodriguez's plans of opening two films, I mean Machete Kills and Sin City, within weeks of each other has been spoiled. At least Machete Kills is still expected to arrive later this year to comfort all those who have been patiently awaiting for another Sin City movie since the first one was released in 2005. Hopefully this will be the last of the delays and we can look forward to seeing Josh Brolin, Joseph Gordon-Levitt and Eva Green together again in 2014. Stay tuned for more updates. Thanks for watching. Follow us on Twitter at FilmIsNow. See you next time.